Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai, my name is Sam, and today we're playing Hex Guardian. Now, I can't believe I'm getting to play this game. Um, I've been following the development for this game, um, because I'm a huge fan of the Yogg's cast, and, you know, I've watched all the videos that they were making about this game, and the early development for this game, and I've been so excited to actually finally get to play it, so. Welcome to the world of Hex Guardian. In this brief tutorial, you will learn the basics of placing defenses and shaping the terrain. I'm not sure if I'm a... I, I think I preferred their more, like, the more medieval look before. Um, before the this axis of it that was released, but... I mean, whatever. I, I'm just happy I'm finally actually playing the game, so I mean, I can't, can't really be upset that much, right? Every night, enemies will appear from active portals enemies move towards the castle along the road or river we need to stop them from reaching the castle it is necessary to place defenses along enemy paths click on the build arrow tower button okay move the mouse to where you want it built then click on confirm okay arrow tower has been built automatically click quickly advance the night button to enter night immediately okay let me build another. I'm gonna just. Put, okay. Learn how to place a new land tile. Click on the build land tile. Oh, yeah. Move the mouse to where you want it placed, then click it to confirm. Uh, right uh, right clicking rotates the grid. Okay. See, this is a very interesting roguelike. So, the whole premise of this is you have different pathways where um, enemies, enemies can come from. And you kind of want to limit the pathways, right? So, it wants me to put it here, but this would be a perfect... Oh, whatever. It wants me to put it there. Would have been better right there, though. Due to the expansion, the path of the enemies has changed. We now have a greater defense path. Let's build another arrow tower on the newly expanded land to better defend against invaders. Let's build another arrow tower. Placing new land tiles in the right locations. Yeah. So, so you want to kind of like block off and limit the amount of spaces that enemies can uh, can attack you from. Your castle's HP de decreases each time an invader reaches the castle. Game ends when it reaches zero. Okay. That makes sense. Okay. Still not following instructions, apparently. Let's go with our archery range. Where are we supposed to put this? See, if I could have just blocked off that, then we wouldn't have to deal with these. Place an archery range on the riverbank to intercept them. Let's put it there. Uh, automatically recruit two, uh, two archers. They will automatically uh, re-recruit when they die. Okay. So, yep, and then our archers will just attack the boats. Which is always nice. Tamed another stone. Click on the build new tile. Okay. See, yeah, and see, now I can block off their pathway, and now no more enemies can come from this way, because it ends in a loop. Great job. The new lane tile connects the two entrances of the river, which means that enemy boats can no longer enter from here. See, so, yeah, this is what, like, makes it different, is that you can literally block off pathways. Uh, so it deals an area of effect. We'll attack from both the south and northeast, but the path on the south is far too short. Um... Okay, I guess we gotta put that there. Okay, there we go. Just show you we can have the archers assist in defense. Click on the archer. Click on the reposition, and we'll put it there. Reposition the rally, yeah, yada, yada, yada. Still can't fast forward. Okay. So again, yeah, now we have archers and they'll help out. Depends on the right side is struggling. Didn't really seem like it was struggling, but okay. Ooh, now he attacks two units at the same time. That's actually pretty nice. A pretty nice upgrade there. Okay, we completed the the tutorial. Now can we actually play the normal game? Yep, there we go. And we have talents as well. This is something that I did not know about. Uh...
go with that, though. Go for more money. Let's start this area. Okay. Now we're getting into a real game. Enemies will appear from portals when night falls. Don't let them reach the castle. Build your defense system. Click on a building to construct it. Okay. And then, yeah, let's put that there. Okay. Let's just skip to the night phase. Each drop, which contains the power to shape the... Okay. So, yeah, we already know about that and what that stuff does. So... Uh, I guess we can just ex kind of expand that out. Just so it's just so that this tower has a little bit more time to attack them. Rather than it being, like, right up close. Um. Honestly, an ice tower would probably be better. Okay, we have two, we have three now. Okay. Yeah, let's send it this way. Can I? Not, I, I guess I can't put that there. Okay. Let's just do that, and then. Let's focus on blocking off, like, these two, like, connecting those two. Oh, that increases the cost for that. Oopsies. And let me guess, it doesn't deal any damage. Oh, it does. Shoot. Oh, okay. Increase the attack range. Yeah, that was really bad. Okay, um... Okay, but at least they're coming from over here. So we should be in a good spot here. We can speed speed up this part, I guess. Uh, go for an archery range. Can I not? I can't put that there. Okay. Okay, we can block that part off. Okay. Okay, yep, I get it. Send them over there. Can I upgrade the archery range? No. Put them, like, right there. They should get destroyed pretty quickly, especially with the archers there. Um, critical... Just go with that, I guess. Yeah, this is not good. Uh, I guess I could go with that. Then connect that up.
Whatever. We'll do this. This is a very bad, bad position. Maybe archers would have been better. Oh wait, hold on. Pause. I forgot I can at least... I should at least have these guys over to here. This would at least help a little bit. Maybe not a lot, but at least a little bit. Okay, I did very badly on my first run, but that's why it's a first run, and things are destined to go very badly. But it's fine. It's fine. Oh, the fact that that branches off into two kind of sucks. Uh, oh, let me... Okay. Okay. At least I can pause, which is nice. Wanna put water somewhere? I guess I could just expand that out. Ah, uh, that brings it to there. But I think that's my best bet for that. And yeah, whatever. Should hopefully be enough to take them out. I'm hoping. Um. Yeah, see, they did. They did quite well there. And this is a river. Well, then let's try to combine. These two. Here. Okay, water units aren't showing up yet, so we're... Should be okay for now. Definitely need some defenses over here eventually, though. Can we get... Oh my gosh. Even when we block this part off, we still get that. Okay. Maybe I should have gone for over here. I don't know. Let's just go for that. Okay. Just skip to the night, because why not? Oh, wait. There 
I guess most of our defenses are here anyways, so... It's not like the end of the world, but... I think, um, I think I'm making a lot of mistakes. I think at, at the current point in time, I think it's a little too late to fix said mistakes. I think that's the problem. Um, okay. Let's go with that. Oh, shoot. There's boats coming from over there. Well, we're just gonna have to... Oh, okay, yep. They... I guess that's probably the best... Way to go about that. Yeah, we'll go with that. So why not? Um, go for attack range. Nice. I'm just trying to make sure I have all of the different possible areas blocked off with what could possibly happen. Uh, and at some point we might end up just having boats coming through, which I'm honestly fine with. Keep forgetting I need to move my archers around. Gosh dang it. Keep forgetting I need to move my archers. Okay. We're gonna save our talent points. We're gonna try this again. I keep losing on day five. I need to I need to play this a little bit a little bit smarter. Like, I could definitely do better than this. I just am not, for whatever reason, being very smart. I don't know what that was, but... I'm not sure why it got destroyed. All I know is I'm going to do that. You know what, let's go for the ice tower. We could combine those two, but I'd rather just have that kind of off to the side, honestly. But 
but now there's units coming from over here. And I should have paid attention to that. But of course I didn't. Now we're probably going to lose. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Okay, let's just, yeah, let's sacrifice a little bit of health for the sake of fully blocking off this part here. There we go. Honestly, I don't know. Might just put that over there. Gosh dang it. Well, I'm telling you, like, none of this stuff is really helping me. Okay, that kind of helps, I guess. There's boats coming from here, and I would rather, like, it loop onto there, but it's not. That's what I need it to do. But it's not doing it. Which is freaking annoying. Honestly, I'll do that, though. Have the water... Yeah, there we go. Um. Okay. Why can't I turn that? I don't understand. Honestly, we'll go with that, and then we'll just kind of, I guess, try to loop these two around. And see how that goes. What even is, what's this? It's just houses.
Oh yeah, there's chests and stuff. I should have paid attention to that. There's like chests around that you can collect. It's actually not something that I knew. Should have should be paying more attention to that, like I said. Okay. Well we got some more gold. Let's just upgrade some of these towers, I guess. Um, go with that. Okay. I... Okay. There we go. Now we can try to loop that back around. I think that's our best... Best bet. Can I have this thing target? Like... I wish you could have it, like, target... A certain type of enemy or something. Right now, yeah, I wanted to target um, um, whatever it's called. <laughs> I can't think of what, what I'm trying to say. I wanted to target the boats. I wonder if I can have it. A little risky though. I don't know, I guess just in just in the off chance that it works, I'll do that. Let me increase the attack range. Archer towers. Hopefully that should help a little bit. Oh my gosh. Every single time I seemingly connect it, it just has to be like, nope, never mind. Joke's on you. Just kidding. Come on. I just want to get past this level. Please, I'm so close. Oh my gosh. We actually made it. We made it through. Okay, we have a bunch of boats coming from that way. I'm gonna do that. It should hopefully be enough to take to take out these guys. Nope, never mind. Boats was a little too hard, I guess. Swordsman. Um. Maybe that. Maybe the observatory would be good. Um. Extra, extra card up, upgrade card chance. Ah, oh, I don't know. This does seem good, though. She's a blessing on day two. That seems good. I don't know what that does, but. Um, okay. Oh, we unlocked, okay. 
Now we're on the, the desert. So let's see. See if we can do better here. Water sources. Ah. Okay, well, let's pause things real quick. Okay. Just put that there. with that and then try to loop this around I guess. I'll just build this like off to the side. Um, okay. Seems like it's doing pretty well. Oh, the, here's the oasis. That's a lot of units there, so I'm a little worried about that. But yeah, that's definitely a lot of units coming on that side. Uh. See, I wish they would actually attack the units up front rather than the units that are closest to them. But the thing is, that's what they're doing, is they're just attacking the units that are closest to them. Which is not what I want. <laughs> Oh, there's a chest there. Oh, that was a hundred gold. Okay. We upgrade that then. Uh, go for more attack speed. Okay. Um. There we go. Whatever. That works. We'll just go with this. Go for the best.
<sighs> no guarantee that this setup works, but we're gonna hope it does. Another oasis? Okay. Not really what I need right now. Oh my gosh, three pathways, are you kidding me? And then that just com- okay. I mean, I guess that at least combines them into that, but... Things are not looking too hot for me right now, I'm gonna be honest with you. Yeah, these guys are getting very close. A lot closer than I want them to get. They're getting a lot stronger as well than I would want them to get. This is... This is not good. Not good at all. Do that. Honestly, let's just do this. Screw it. Oh, great, airships. So we've had this thing of setting up, you know, roads and defenses, and now we just, now we just have things that completely ignore all of it. <sighs> Choose a blessing. Yeah, let's go with, well, let's just go with the blessing and then we'll go with that, I guess. Anyways, I think that's going to be it for today's video of Hex Guardian. I absolutely love this game. Um, and there's so much more to this game that I can't wait to try out in the, in the future, whenever this game is fully unlocked or uh, whenever it it's fully released. I'll try to get a, a copy of it. Um, hopefully before then. But, you know, we'll see how it goes. Um, but yeah, my name is Sam. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Hex Guardian. If you did, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. I mean, the world to me doesn't cost you guys anything. And yeah, hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.